Hi, welcome back to Tales of Vesperia. A monster might run into me while I'm deleting stuff from my trash bin. Nope. Anyway, we were trying to figure out how to get the seafood bowl recipe and we couldn't remember how to do it. We will worry about that in a bit. More importantly, at the immediate moment, let's go back to where the sky is nice, dark, and pretty. Oh, there it is. It's terrifying. It actually is pretty pretty. I don't know how you guys are talking about. Also, we uh we got stabbed by Sodia. That was hilarious. That was certainly a thing that happened. If you press L and R, you just get a free reverse button or a go forward button. Guess it's kind of nice to have that so you can control where you're landing. Largely pointless, however. I think this is the incorrect side if we want to run into the beak, but the guy isn't here. Honestly, what we need to do right now is just do the story until we're allowed to do a bunch of the fun shit. Which, I don't remember exactly what we were doing. We were supposed to go to... Oh, oh, oh we're, we're, I don't remember. Yeah, we have to go to this thing over here. Let's, uh... Pull the map. It's over here. Here. We have to go to this stuff. I don't know where specifically we have to land. Here, I think? I mean, it looks different, so... Yeah. We will not go easy on you! Birds. It'd it be time. I see fall! No, you already did drive to fall. Ooh, that was kind of nifty. I like all my moves right now, so I don't know how much I want Lone Wolf Charge. Keeps getting these moves that I'll never use. Unleash power in the form of a wolf. The fuck does that mean? <laughs> you know. I also got Dangerous Ladder uh, last time, when I was grinding. I don't know if I want Dangerous Ladder, but it's a thing. Yeah, fuck it, go Maybe. for it. Uh, it's not a close. So. Uh, but here's how Dangerous Ladder works. Um, it's high-low. I have to repeatedly go, hi, whoa, whoa, hi, hi, whoa. Yeah. And every time I guess right, I get a gunshot, but if I guess wrong, a bomb explodes in my face. Yeah, go for it. I remember the I AI using it. it a bunch. Mm -hmm. You'll have to equip that on me, though, so I could do it. This, apparently, we're not supposed to go to yet. It's wrong menu. Uh, fucking one of the clucky bombs, maybe? Uh, the back funky bomb. I never use back funky bomb anyway. Okay. High is... I don't know what those are on this controller, but I'll figure it out. Here, give it a try. I suppose I could try. Okay, that was... I actually am not sure. Okay. Uh... Is a literal full deck. Okay, I fucking want to hit my joystick. Okay, that's guessing high. Okay. Nope, I hit the wrong button. That was wonderful. That's that's getting that will take some getting used to. Channel your inner power from the glorious game that is Dragon Quest. Oh, well, I I can play high-low. It's figuring out which button is high and which one is low that I'm figuring out right now. You gotta now. know when to hold them. Know when to fold them. Alright, so where the fuck did we actually go, then? 
Do we go to the jellyfish? Actually, I think I'm like... Hmm, it might be like that. Let me look at a PlayStation controller real quick. This actually might make logical sense. I yeah, it's it. left and right. So, square is left, circle is right. That's what I thought it would be. Yeah, that makes sense. So, if you're using, like, a Switch Pro controller, then that's, that's probably what it would be. I saw completely forget. Like, I went to go look at a fucking PlayStation controller, forgot that I'm now hooked into my computer by a cable. A not very long cable, because it's the only one that I've got that works right now. Alright, it's not this time. Not dicking around. No fear rift? No. Hmm. Seems like that's where they want us to be, but I don't where know. Where the fuck is Zofir Rift? I don't know. I thought it was that thing over there. <clears throat> it's the icy area on the north side of Ilica, large continent. Where Aspio, Image Hill, such are. The entrance to the dungeon is a crystal and swords sticking out of the ice. So, somewhere by the icy area, there is a crystal with swords sticking up out of the ice. Question mark. Oh, this shit over here? Maybe. This is a fat load of nothing. Northwestern side of Ilica. Elysia, whatever the fuck. That's, That's the ice thing, right? I mean, maybe. I don't... Actually, which so, continent Elysia, is Elysia, that's the one with Hilaire. Is this the one with Hilaire right here? Yeah, that's Hilaire. Okay. So, Northwest... Uh, if you're going there because of story from Nor Harbor, you need to go near Amid Hill. Look at your map. There should be a thin strip of land to the side of the mountain heading north. Follow that. Should hit the ice. This feels like it's the wrong fucking thing. Wait, is the Zophir Rift the ice itself? Is that what that ice area is called? It might very well be. Either way, we need to find the entrance to the dungeon with fucking... I think uh, we need to enter from the one this side. Pretty tough. This mm -hmm. one's for real! Hi. Oh, oh. I shouldn't have said hi on a nine. What am I doing? I was a seven, I thought. Uh, nine is what I ended up with. Hi. No, I did. I was too slow. Hi. Two? Come on now. I'm not a big fan of this move. I'll figure it out though. I just want to see you get it right once. You got it right two. What's your luck right now? Dude, what the fuck is happening? It was a luck. three. That was a sure fire. Hi! Low. God damn it. Low. Low. <laughs> this is so hard. I think you have to spam it. You have to do it so fast. You don't even don't think about you, like... it. Don't even think about it. Just keep doing it. Well, that did better, but I mean... That's what you have to do. It's, it's dangerous. You don't even fucking think about it. You literally don't have time to play low eye. It's literally just eat a dick, guess, motherfucker. Pretty much. It doesn't seem very good. But. It's a funny idea for a spell. I'll say that. Come on, Wayne. But like, but like just by comparison, like, you have things on her such as. Summon a goddamn tidal wave from God. <laughs> that was a 
nice little break. You know. Dangerous Ladder to me feels like something she should have gotten very early on, honestly. That feels like a move that would have been good earlier. Can I not call the... I guess I can't call the thing here. Oh, for fuck's sake. What did I even run into? Nothing? Ice Wolf that was spawning in. Okay, that will work just fine. See, now that's a better move. Yeah, see, like, that's what I mean when I'm saying, like... Dangerous Ladder would have been good earlier when I didn't have the power of God and anime on my side. <laughs> Man, I want some more. Like, I have so many good moves and it's like, the damage output it shits out isn't even that high if you get it right. <laughs> the fuck do I even go? I guess I just keep moving along it. But I do think that it's important that I have it because it there's an altered art for it that I think is actually all right. So we'll get to that at least. Is that? Yeah. Yeah. Blade drifts is. Severe. We saw a sword. Oh, it's gold, gold, <laughs> gold. So gold, 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 gold. So, what are you gonna do with the air crane? Yeah, what are you going to do, Patty? Or Patty? I'm going to use the energy to make an air converter. An air converter? My plan is to efficiently convert the air into matter, decreasing the overall amount of air. But for that, it's ideal to have the converter use energy similar to both air and matter. How is that energy different from air? Elementally separated air transitions into matter in stages and eventually becomes stable. I'm going to stop its transition between the two states and develop a converter formula. So it won't be air or matter? It's a state that's closer to matter than to air, but it's still not quite matter. We call it mana. Mana. To think that one short utterance could hold more gravity than the light used to lure fish out of the frigid sea at night. It actually has a really long, complicated name, but mana's good enough. But it'll still be less stable than actual matter, so we'll need something to act as a core. The Epithea. And a lot of air and Estelle's power to recombine the formula. Using my power without the control formula will unbalance the air. It'll just flood out again. But we can't just sit here and ignore that thing, and... Yeah? It's a bet I'm willing to take. I guess I should be the one trying to stop you, but I'm game to get in on this bet, too. I? I'll wager a billion gold on that. Lower high! Three? That's oh. an easy one! The theory is correct. Three! That's Maybe easy! Two! Fuck! <laughs> I'll return this billion gold to you many times over. Oh, truly now? Yep. Come on, let's head to the air creme. Creme. I'm like genuinely salty about that three. It's freezing. I think there's a cabin or something where we get out of the cold. It's on an ice I don't flood, think dude. anyone would build a cabin on top of a sheet of ice. If we just had some fire. Oh yeah, Rita, use your magic to give us some fire, would you? <laughs> what am I, a walking matchbox? And besides, using it on you would be a waste of air. What's the big deal? Weren't you just using it over and over again just a little while ago? That was to defeat enemies. What would you want me to set on fire anyway? Hmm, you've got a pretty muscular body. Huh? Well, I mean, with the guilds and the knights and all, it's a lot of work. Doesn't look like there's enough fat to burn very well. <laughs> That's too bad. Huh? Hey! I think it's time. The rare moment where we're actually our default outfits. It has actually been a long time. Except for him. He was already his default outfit. <clears throat> There we go. And the creepy old man we run around with. What is that dude over there? 
That's a bird. Oh, that fucker. The fucking dude with giant shields or whatever. I swear to god I've never seen that guy before. And we've done this dungeon. Hmm. You can go fuck him up. I mean, I don't think he's a Giganto monster, but... <laughs> I ain't seen him before. You can fuck him up anyway. Fucking instant turnaround dick. Now we're cooking. Now we're cooking. Let's be cash. <laughs> Such a dumb move. You just gotta spam it. That's how the move works. I mean, that damage is really good. It is good. It's very fast at dealing damage. It's just that fucking it up makes me take like three. 150 damage, and it also wastes so much time <laughs> when it doesn't work. I didn't, I didn't mean to do this, whatever. Fucking overpowered, completely wasteful. I meant to do Dangerous Ladder, but I guess I aimed slightly too high up. Next level I get Card Gamble, which is also stupid. <laughs> I pull a Poker Hand, and the better it is, the better, the more damage it does. <laughs> I tell you, thinking of a converter for air. You're quite the thinker. I actually think Judith is more cold than he That's is. That's our genius mage girl, Rita. Yep, yep. Yeah? Well, I had a hint to go off of. Although, I don't know. Come to think of we it, already established that Raven is bad in the cold. Didn't you? Yeah. Despite its amazing size, it wasn't running off of air, even though it was a barrier blastia to protect the entire world. A barrier blastia? Oh, yeah. They were protecting the world from the Autophagos! You mean to say it's been there for a millennium? It's as dogged as a philosophizing anemone! Same goes for the Autophagos! She just it's shits out random lines and everyone ignores her. Alexei seemed to believe Zod was a weapon, but he couldn't have been more mistaken. But the runaway air was the cause for the Autophagos <clears throat> awakening, wasn't it? Ah, so that's why they would use a barrier running on power other than air. But then, what sort of power was it using? The children of the full moon, perhaps? It was actually energy taken straight from them. Inside that giant core, it continued to power Zod as a virtually perpetual formula. Most likely, the energy was taken in exchange for their lives. The light of life was extinguished from the children of the full moon. So that's what Miorso's legend meant. According to Duke, they did it of their own free will. They wanted to save the world. The love the children of the full moon bore for this world is what created the barrier. The power of love makes you want to cry. They sacrificed themselves for the world. The children of the full moon were protecting us the entire time. Huh? Are you catching a cold, Estelle? No, it's just... I've been so cold ever since I saw Rita use that water magic of hers. That's terrible! Are you sure you're okay? <laughs> now it's both of you? You should just tell Rita to stop using that kind of magic. I can hear Rita already. I'll decide what type of magic I use, thank you very much. Oh, come on. If we tell her that we might be coming down with colds, I'm sure she'll... What's that? Something about me? <laughs> hey, you catch a cold too? Maybe someone's talking about me behind my back. Uh, uh. <laughs> That's Rita for you. Fuck's sake, these birds. Ooh, I can't wait to fight this one. You want to run away? Destruction Street. Your legs are shaking.
Are you ready for that epic fight? The guy who's probably not even there anymore, and I'm almost entirely sure that we've walked past him. No. This looks like fun. Possibly. Yeah, that is card. <laughs> That's a good fucking hand. <laughs> that was a. I, I mean, it fucking killed the guy instantly. Whatever the fuck the hand ended up being. Dan kicked some ass. There's no way we're gonna lose. All right, put card camel or dangerous letter as I'm literally not actually gonna use. This. <laughs> oh come on, it's a great move. It's funny, but it's not good at all. It's a really quick arcane. In fact, that's what it's amazing for. Just use that any time. Like, literally, pick once, and then, like, it does the move. You don't even have to guess. It's just a really fast move. I guess that's fair, but the thing is, I've got very limited move slots, and I'm not using it for anything else. I don't know. Like, I'm probably not able to justify that. Here's the thing. That monster's not gonna show up again, right? We killed it. If it does, you'll beat it up for us just like the last time, right? You're mean. Okay, I'm ready. Estelle, come over here. Now, I'll release the control formula. Once I do that, the air crene will react to you and produce more air. I want you to recompose the air formula into a stable formula closer to mana. Um, I don't understand. Yeah. Okay, the water element is strong here, so imagine flowing water and let your body flow with the air. The theory behind materializing air is the same as performing magic. If Estelle can recompose the air into a state close to mana, then I should be able to guide the air into the cyanocell. Can we do anything? No. Let's go take a nap or something. We'd freeze to death if we took a nap here. Pretty handy, you know. We can cook or fish or anything you want. Just tell us what to do. I wouldn't say anything. We can use the conversion formula we found in Zelda. I forgot she those on. <laughs> yeah. They got replaced. That was for, for substituting life for air. Your life! You can't do that! But if this fails, then we'll all be swallowed up by a flood of air. We'll be dead anyway, right? We're all risking our lives. Let us help. All right. I'll use your life energy to guide the air into the cyanocell. If we do that, I think Estelle will understand the flow of the air without interference from me. All right, everyone. Let's do this. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Why not? Sure. Why not? Ready, Estelle? Here we go. Everyone, come over here. Go ahead. Try and synchronize yourself with my formula. There, that's good. <sighs> Confirm the rules. I'm sorry. Are we Air about conducted? to do... Yeah, we finally get to do one. Try to left the top line in color. <laughs> Press the buttons to respond to the color of air at the correct timing when it oh, overlaps oh, the force right. field. Okay, let's go. Bye, Dame, 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 I have forgotten that bit. <laughs> God, I'm fucking epic. Eventually, we'll get to Yark's Zero. The air we'll get is collecting in the cyanocell. The formula is working. The force field is stable. It's gonna be okay. Uh, uh. 
No, it's the don't coom. Don't jail Crystal. No, we didn't charge the jail Crystal well what enough. Happened? It's because you've missed an input or two. Fucking failure. Yeah. No, it's still under control, but what is this? The formula for reshaping the apatheia. It's reformulating itself. That seems counterintuitive. Oops, we accidentally summoned Undine. You hate to see it. Oh, no, sorry, Undini. It's not Undine. It's Undini. Maybe they'll say it right in this game. <laughs> that voice. Bellius? Yes. It is I, Bellius. Or rather, I was once Bellius. The fucking voice directing in this game. Alright, listen guys, for this next voice, I want you to do the voice regularly and then put it through the echo filter one million times. Yo, what's going yo, on? Yo, uh, instead of recording inside of a uh, sound booth, let's record inside of a tin can. <laughs> Could the will of Bellius <laughs> trapped in the epithet? Let's record inside of a trash can. Oh, thank God. My command. I am the ruler of the waters. I wonder what we shall call thee. Okay. Miss Big Undini so has quite the tits work. on her in this game. Yeah. <laughs> it's gone way beyond working. I never thought it would gain a will of its own. Nature's mysteries will forever transcend the limited scope of our imagination. I like it how all the tale stories are basically intertwined with each other. Yeah. Yeah, in this game, the summoned one. spirits were briefly turned into Entelikea or something? Entelikea were turned into summoned spirits now. That, that's what we're going towards. We're, so is this implying this one happened before all those other games then? Probably. If you think so, about it, Tales of Symphonia is a prequel to Tales of Fantasia. So this is even earlier in the timeline. In theory, okay. if it's all the same world. So, the, yeah, the implication is the Entelikea were originally a race, and then they became the Summon Spirits. Okay. I sure. mean, there aren't too many places with land and continents and people, so... Humans? What creature am I? Though no longer Bellius, the Entelikea, you have granted life to me. I ask Ah, uh, they're the ones that are responsible. A being that controls the essence of a material. Maybe you're a spirit. Okay. And so my name shall be the Splishy Splashy Watercolor Queen. I hope that I wish that that's what they stuck with. That'd be dumb. An ancient word great. for the ruler of the waters. How about Undine? Oh my God, they said it correctly. It's Undine. it's closer. I would still call Undine, but I Undine's closer. Ah. At oh. least it's not Undine. Oh yes, the well. Oh. It wasn't any cakewalk either. Receive this now as token of my thanks. Take a bunch of bullshit. Undine. Take a couple we weapons, I guess. He just said Undini. Oh, what the? God damn it! Voice director. <laughs> I want to know who's the voice director. My fucking god. Huh? <laughs> who's responsible for this? It was different, because, like, in Dragon Quest, uh, in Dragon Quest, we knew who to blame, right? We always had a name <laughs> on file who to bitch at, right? For all we don't have that related here. Nonsense. The elements of Earth, yeah. water, wind, and fire. We need at least three more. We'll need help from the other Entelikea, won't we? I. There are very few Entelikea left. Can we have your Sarah, life Lucius? so we can make... And Ba'ul. Not Ba'ul. He hasn't taken in enough air to create an apatheia, and on top of that, I won't allow it. Undine, I mean, do you have any ideas? we would lose no, our said Undine. What the... The shining forest Again, let's be very clear. Voice director. Fuck him. Or her. I'm not gonna identify the gender, I guess. She disappeared! <laughs> no. She is here. I feel her. It seems like the air crinet has quieted down too, even though we're not controlling Estelle's power. Really? So, Undine is controlling Estelle's power? 
I forget if you have to do the dance dance thing for every single one of them. You mean Estelle is really free? Really? Wendy Lee is yes. the voice director? That's great, Estelle. Wendy Lee. Wendy Lee. Doesn't she do, no, like, no. a shit ton of things? Oh, she does so many voice... Uh, she's a voice yeah, actor. She does a ton of fucking of games. Alright, Wendy Lee. Uh, here, welcome. Oh, nice! I can't wait to do a voice. Oh, no, you're not doing a voice. You're doing all of them. What? Yeah, yeah just uh, direct you're, us, you're the, you're the voice director. I don't have experience with that! I finally see the light at the end. It's a pinprick, but as welcome as the rays of sun that pierce into the ocean's depths. <laughs> She's fucking Colette, I think. Wendy Lee? No, she isn't. I think Colette's voice actor is a very rare person who doesn't really do much. Hold on, I need to fucking find <laughs> Rita, Wendy you Lee's IMDb happy. page. So do you, Yuri. There's no longer anything shackling Estelle. She can use her power without causing any harm to herself or unbalancing the come. air. So yeah, I'm happy. Estelle's really free! There's no guarantee she won't overdo things again, though. We'll just so watch her closely. Things. If we don't, she might go back to healing people till she keels over. She's Fuka. Oh, oh Fuka. Fusana. Oh, that Fuka. Oh, that. so that 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 voice actor. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Apparently, she is the one responsible for the voice direction in this game. Um, which honestly, you know, I don't think that she's. Regularly a voice. What the what fuck the is that? What the fuck is that? We'll destroy them in no time. What the fuck are you? A snow spirit. <laughs> okay. It is. It seems a little stronger than the average enemy, maybe, but. A gamble. Yeah. A straight. Was that a straight? Terrible. Yeah, that was a straight. All right. Well, that was even better than your previous one. Let's see what else I can pull. These are just funny. Three of a kind. I wonder how it treats that, because the time that I did pretty good, that was a two pair. Yeah. It was a high two pair. It was a, like a K and a queen two pair or something. Here we go. Yay! The fact that you've gotten a straight a two pair and a three pair with three hands is like kind of impressive. Alright, here's the big bastard. He is not a uh, giant. He's absolutely fucking nothing. Like, let's see what else we can pull. Three of a kind. I think that it's rigged to give you some kind of a hand. I don't know if it can give you a nothing. We'll see. One pair. Nothing. There you go. Uh, nothing can happen. Alright, now we're getting the proper luck. You picked the wrong. You got the Joker. Yeah, Yuri's the Joker, I think. I think that means it's a wild card. Mm hmm. Gotcha. We'll <clears throat> I'm just fucking around with this, seeing what I can get. If I got a fucking royal flush, that would be hilarious. A flush? That was pretty good. Anyway. It's a little time consuming, because it has a casting phase. So. Realistically, it's not that good because I already have access to advanced spell button. Yeah. Like, if it casts the same way as the advanced spell, I might as well use the advanced spell. There's no risk there. I'm gonna get something that? good. Did you see me yeah, that was like, dumb. Whoosh. It's weird because that's inconsistent. Also, there's a chest inside. Huh. I need a stronger ring. Okay. Anyway, yeah, um... Yeah. Nuts. Focus on the enemy in front! Oh, well, I guess that's one downside. 
was like, you know, this one can still fail. But then, when it succeeds, you get stuff like that, so I mean, you know. I, I, there was one thing, like, card gamble's cheaper by a lot, but, like, that's not an issue when Flame Big Chef just makes TP. It does have an altar part, though. It's the altar part that it becomes. Mahjong. I guess we'll see if Mahjong is good when that comes around. Keep your eyes on my sword. Easy. Are we a master of making steak yet? Oh, so what did it still have to cook to find new recipes? I think she's done. I'm done. But let me check. Uh, bu 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 she's bu done bu steak. Does this very good food? Maybe. Figure that out for you. See if there's anything Estelle should be cooking that she hasn't. Estella's made a sandwich. Uh, Estella's made fried chicken and fries, I think. Yeah, that, we have the Scottish egg. Estella minestrone soup makes miso soup. I know we have that because we have clam chowder, I think. No, yeah. maybe we don't, actually. She makes minestrone for miso, then she makes miso for clam chowder. We have clam chowder, so we know that we're already done with all that. Yeah. She's done, then. That's all that she cooks to make to get recipes. Okay. We're being caught. We're being slowed down by Vichy Schwaz and Crepe. Those are the things we. We also need a seafood bowl, but those three things will let us unlock everything else. <clears throat> then, since we have every single recipe, we can get the final one, which is I forget what it's called, but it's like something special. Mm -hmm. Is it good? Does it do everything? No. Doubtful. It's just the uh, the final recipe. Like, it'd be neat if, like, the reward for doing all that was you got, like, the full meal, you know? It does it all. But it's really expensive, maybe, in terms of, like, the supplies you need to craft it. I don't know. Like, something where you wouldn't really cook it at the end of battle, but maybe, like, you know, between battles? Fuck do I know. Okay. We will not go easy on you! Okay. You see me go over limit from just beating the shit out of that guy? Wasn't too bad. That's why I love. I that mean, move. it's hard to. It's hard to see it sometimes because, um, randomly the game is doing the stuttery thing. So. Mm. Fair enough. It's lucky enough that I can usually get through battles by spamming. Yeah. Yeah. All right here. Is Undine really here? Yes. I can't really explain it, but she is here. I can sense it. Perhaps she dwells within Estelle. Well, she was created to I Estelle. I want to dwell within Estelle. So maybe the two are connected. Very interesting. Hey, save the research for later, okay? I know, I know. You don't have to... What, what was that just now? Isn't that where... It came from the direction of Zaude. Uh -oh. No, don't mess with the wedding ring. No. Yo, 
go, we broke through the matrix. <laughs> it's Chicken Little, the sky is falling. <laughs> What am I supposed to interpret this thing as supposed to look like? It's just a bunch of fucking, like, purple testicles writing from the sky. <laughs> yeah. Is it an octopus? I don't know. Gibbies. The Atafagos. No. Has Zaudi stopped working? Uh-oh. Do you think we might have done something to set this off? That is the true catastrophe. That thing does look like it could eat the whole world. What are we supposed to do about something like that? It's a touch too big to fillet with just my kitchen knife. All right, hey, little Rita, big Duke shit. Duke said the Autophagos was born from shit. air. I don't know, maybe with the right plate up squad, who knows? Huh? I don't know. That looks like day 87. Most we've done is 15. So if the spirits convert air into that dude, matter, like that's like the fucking final boss. He comes in as a customer, not could we do cooking. something about the autophagos if we had enough spirits? I don't know. I just I don't know, but I do think it's worth a try. Let's try it, Yuri. Then it's settled. Baul. Yes, I see. Thank you. The servants of the Atafagos are attacking a city. Nordapalaka. <gasps> I guess we can't ignore something like that. Let's go. Nordapalaka. Oh, I'm gonna hurt that idiot who brought the Atafagos back. He's dead. What could have happened at Zaude? Those nut jobs probably fiddled with the thing too much and broke it. Thanks to Alexei, Zaude's no longer functioning like it was meant to. Greed always eats itself. That wouldn't be a problem if there weren't other victims. This guy just never learns, does he? Things are gonna have to hit bottom before he consider changing his ways. But they see that thing about to eat the planet, right? Even an idiot would understand the situation. I sure hope so. It's funny to me that, like, a lot of these side quests and shit don't become available until after the fucking planet-devouring octopus shows up, like... Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, you know, we were cleaning the hot springs for a while, but, you know, now that the octopus is here... I mean, basically, that's how it would be, like, I, like that shit spawn would be like, alright, you know, no, screw cleaning. Just go enjoy it. Okay, okay, here's, here's my counterpoint. That thing appears, why are we running a business at <laughs> this time? What are you supposed to do? You can't fight it. I actually am not sure what you're supposed to do, I just feel like people would panic. Uh, remember, like, a couple years ago when there was, like, an accidental nuclear alarm sent to Hawaii? I don't remember that. was that. a test, but they did not say it was a test. People were freaking the fuck out. Hmm. That was big news for a week. Everyone was just like, good fucking job, Hawaii. Man, could you be any weaker? One shot should do. Victory? Now it's even prettier. Yeah, really, I mean, not a Fagos. He ain't so bad, right? Jeez. That's say that section of the world is very powerful. It outpowers even the autofagos. <laughs> it must rain. Yeah, it turns out all we really needed to beat the autofagos was some arbitrary section of random fog. And I guess the- I guess he's just not a thing anymore, because now the sky's blue? I don't fucking know. <laughs> we gotta check every time we do any story element if they're done. Well, more specifically, I just wanted to buy some more shit. Ah. Fair enough.
It's also been a while since I've checked Smithen. Good thing this is actually, one of those hot springs where they hike all the prices on staying, but not the prices on actually buying shit. Yeah, that's like really backwards, because like that's not how hotels and shit work. No. I mean, they, they do they do charge you, but straight up, their business model is to get you to fucking uh, buy shit. Yeah, they charge you out that. Oh. Uh, it's only on Flynn, that's boring. Flynn's not even our party anymore. Mm. It's a Michael Jackson hat. Spent five eight man costumes on that. Y'all. Hey, World Charm? Excellent. You can make it. It's excellent. Excellent accessory. Oh, we need a rope or tentacle for the talisman. Better than some cheap armor. I can make a fairy ring. Damn. Nah. This must be really rare material, so you can just make that with them. You can only carry one of each, so I assume they're once per game. I mean, maybe if they're only used for that, I just don't know that that's true. Reduces all damage by 15% is kind of interesting. Yeah, it's not that special. It's the king of all cosmos! That's a Katamari Damacy. Yeah, actually, that's funny. <laughs> uh. Reduce casting time. Neat. Rate of over limit gauge. Neat. Ah, increases luck. Just what I need. It doesn't do that much, I don't think. I actually think it does quite a bit. Well, I... The thing is, I logistically don't know how Patty's skills work. I don't know if her luck stat actually matters. <laughs> but I'm inclined to think it does. Because one of her skills called Happy Light increases her luck by 30 when you use it. Hmm. Which implies to me that luck matters for her, somehow. Yeah. Your gun? No, you That's, already we've already had Cerulean. It's fine. Still can't get them. Can't get any of her boots. Ever. <laughs> Look, she's not allowed to step on you. The it's lovely not allowed. cat dick. I already have all of mine. The cat's guard? What? That was a book. It's a lovely. No, there's cat a cat. There's a cat's guard up there. Oh yeah, look at that. Pow hammer revenge. revenge. Oh, <laughs> all right. <laughs> Hyperion, I love them. They're so nice. Everyone knows that they're, like, perfect for how nice they are. Highlander. Hyperion? They're known for being, you know, the best of the uh, companies in Borderlands. Ooh! I like doing that. Yeah, I wonder if she has enough of them. Do we have Zephyrus? I don't know if we have Zephyrus. It's pretty hard to tell if we have that. I don't know if I ever finish off the Rune Blade.
If you had, it would display it, right? It's like not done yet, but also I don't care. I'd rather use everything else. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Recover would be really nice. Dude, hand axe. Great. It's just a really shitty piece of crap. Weapon. Except in Fire Emblem, where it's amazing. Hmm. Need another Tabar in order to get immunity and life healer. Should be nifty. Death Scythe. for on though and she hasn't finished it yet so I wouldn't even mess with that. It's anymore. just special so hmm. that shit is like super good on her because of the extra strength and magic basically turns into a super weapon. That's really good. Oh, that's irrelevant. Wait. <laughs> Wait a minute. I mean, equal to an enemy's HP, that would be her entire TP back, if that happens. Yeah, that's kind of insane. money yeah it's okay here These are all upgrades that that one. Alright, we'll take a look through these. I'm sure we have some garbage over there. We have a moonstone. Neat. Makes one very sensitive. I have 100 luck right now. Get to my level. Anyway, here's what this does for you. Oh, what? That sucks. It raises it by a whole seven. Oh, boy. Lucky seven, I guess. 
Oh man, that oh boy, seven. I whole guess I'm lock. thinking of the uh, the rabbit charm that Colette gives you. That shit raises it by like thirty. Yeah, if it raised it by like a ton, then that'd be good. But Don't think too hard on that. <laughs> what, the body paint? Applied body paint to... <laughs> child. As I said, don't think too hard about it. Game set was allowed. There you go, see, now we're in the money again. Eh, some. It's Athenor. Athenor. I gotta check. You gotta go get a treant flower and a green light stone for you. Athenor turns card gamble into mahjong. Ah, well, there you go. Dispersion. That's another one. Hold on. I think you already have that. Yeah, you already have that. Oh, I already have dispersion. Yeah, we're good there. This would just give you magic three, which would be nice, since you do use magic a lot. Roasted fish? The fuck was that? You have it already. You already used oh, it. Oh, already. Oh, okay. Huh. I'm tempted to just nice. get you this, because you don't care too much about strength, but this would be, well... I guess strength is a little alright. You need Fungus Powder MX. Yo, Fungus Powder MX. Uh, but anyway, for that one we'd need, like, a fucking or green light stone. I don't even know where to begin with those. Probably have to go find the Roper. That'd be funny. Trant, Flower, Sparrow. Uh... North of the spa, on those islands, from the big stumpy looking tree things. Okay, well. And then the green white stone. <laughs> Said north from the spa? Said north from the spa on those islands, look for the stumps. That's what it claims. That's not north. Although I don't know what that would imply here. I don't... They said from the stumpy looking things, but I don't... Uh... Here's one. I'm sure it's Yerzo Crystals and Philophora. North of the spa, but there isn't anything north of the spa. I need one character to elaborate. Uh, I can drop off Trium called Blooms. Look at your map, look for the Suizani Island Chains, and they spawn on those islands at night only. Where the fuck is Suizani Island? <laughs> is this it? I don't know what Suizani Island is. Is this it? I don't... Is there any way of knowing that? <laughs> anyway, we gotta go to Napolica. Whatever, it's not that big a deal, but... We will possibly do it at a later period of time. Not a big deal. I don't think Mahjong is going to be that much better. It would just be showing it off to show it off. It'll still have the long casting animation because it's still a spell attack. So, um, problem. If I'm going to be doing that anyway, might as well use the overpowered one. Looks like we got a fight to do. 
that I'm not prepared for. Not nice prepared eight smash. Ha! <laughs> I wish we had this earlier. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> come on now. <laughs> Look! It's hanging on to the city! That black thing. That's what we saw in the sands of Kogor. That was Pharaoh's vision. This is real. Be careful. It looks like it's trying to eat the air of the shield. Is the Atafagos drawn to air? This thing looks pretty mean. It may be, but it's what we've caught on our line. We'll reel it right in. Come on. Let's play cards with it. Two of them. Good thing I'm using a real shit weapon. Also, those are different enemies. You have to magic lens them both. Yeah. Good shit. Thanks, asshole. I'm really bad at finding out here sometimes. <laughs> There's that recovery. Make the fire? Alright, I got this guy. Get up. Stop being stunned. No, the house shouldn't be winning. Come on now. Oh, it's healing him. God damn it. Yeah, that's what I'm doing the fire. Well, sure, but it's... I don't know... It might be a little risky. I'll just... I guess that's why it's called Risky Cast. Yeah, I suppose so. Yeah, give us Tidal Wave now. Is that... At least that doesn't heal it. <laughs> I only switched to this one because I get Crimson Flare, like, really often. <laughs> and I don't want to be risking healing it. God, that's so useful to be able to recover instantly. I think Tidal Wave heals this one. God damn it. <laughs> that's what I said. Literally, like, yeah, get Tidal Wave. And it's immune to light. Okay, we're just not. No, it wasn't. It was getting up. Oh, okay. All right, pal. I wish I could do that. Also, why am I doing that? I literally... If he's weak to fire, I literally have a fire move. Uh, the reason is because, holy fuck, this thing just doesn't take damage for shit. <laughs> I'm literally using, like, a complete-ass weapon. God damn it, Tidal Wave! You're killing it's the other the right... one, at least. Yeah, I guess Tidal Wave hits uh, the entire field, so upside. I've done about half his health, very slowly. Holy Lance. Okay, well that did some damage. There you go. Yeah, that'll do quite a bit, Jim. Like a ground dasher. Did I kill okay. it? Oh my god, I killed it. Oh, well, yeah, I mean, we were both uh, spamming it down. I was fighting the same guy. <laughs> Please, pal. It doesn't even do that much damage. It was just like a meme to do that. Oh, I guess I can... Is it too risky to do this? It's, uh, it's fine. It's fine. Now we're cooking. Alright, which friend will help us out? Squids. I think that's the cart. Yeah. Oh, there you are. Oh, there you are, asshole with a cart that does 30,000 damage.
It is unreasonable the asshole with a cart does that much damage. That was easy. I hope the town is alright. Let's go check it out. Hurry! That was easy, but that took forever. I can do it. Yeah, we didn't struggle at all. It just took eight centuries. Did I max out my hand axe? Fuck no, you Hold wish. We're gonna stop them here. Alright, Dojima. Never mind, they're dead. Things getting wild around here. A little bit. You are. You are. Oh. I guess I'm saved again. It seems that this was the only city to be attacked. What bad luck. This isn't about luck. Where were you, Rita? I went to check the barrier of Lastia. Its power had been raised, and I guess the monsters were drawn to it. The power is returned to normal now. We thought raising the power would protect us, but it turned out to be the opposite. I'll go see the citizens. Feel free to rest here as long as you please. Thanks for the offer, but we still have business to do. We better get moving. You are all welcome at any time. Try stopping by when you have the time. Thanks, Thanks. for killing our boss, dickhead. No, no, no but your cool. boss, it's, uh, she's alive again. Now she's Undini. Ew. I can't Ooh. believe the Autofagos could spawn such a disgusting I'm pretty monster. sure that's not how you pronounce oh, it. The illusion Pharaoh yeah, showed here us. she is. He was trying to make us feel she's the power of the Autofagos. But it's no illusion this time. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Are hordes of these things just gonna I don't know. I'm really everything? more of a furry. I liked her better oh, before. <laughs> hey, no fighting! It's all right, Repeat. He's just a little nervous, that's all. And what's wrong with being a little nervous? I'm not gonna run away or anything, I swear! Repeat eating. Poor little kid. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Well, you're looking her right in the eyes and you still don't know what's going on. Alrighty. That guy was there earlier, too. Like, we had the exact same moment where we went, Oh, okay. Talk yeah. to her. Nothing. Twenty. Four. Hundred. It's a little... It's a little overkill. At this point, what I've since I've determined my own logic for how agility works, I can actually believe it's giving you twenty four thousand agility or twenty four hundred agility, and it just doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> I mean, you can look it up. I don't know. Maybe it matters a whole shit ton. <laughs> These are new. Chris Naga. <laughs> I get it because Chris is secretly a dragon. I really gotta stop guessing Emily's plot lines. I think our four fairness but if it's small the jelly worth the twenty so it's supposed to be twenty percent. Maybe the increase just put the spider on. Yeah, the salad boost is incorrect. Uh mm. So people are basically say that agility affects your movement speed, uh, and it also slightly increases your crit rate. Um but it doesn't scale very well. <laughs> And also the salad displays wrong. 
Gotcha. I got you a new knife, by the way. Oh, uh, yeah? Yeah, it has Gale on it. Alright. Gotta figure out what the fuck that means. Give me one sec. Look how much it increases your agility by. Holy shit. Fade plus three. I've turned Severed Fate into Fader Triangle. I'm not even using Severed Fate right now, but I guess I can equip it so I can spam that. What does that even do? I don't know. Do you even have it? No, I have that unlocked, but I just... It, we never equipped it. Ow. Okay. Uh, Oh, I'll put it on where Trick Trick is for now. I don't know. Just so I can spam it easier. <laughs> we'll fix it later. If it ends up being bad. Maybe it's a really good move. Also, I didn't check my hand axe. Or anyone else's inventory to see if they need to work on stuff. Nats was really working hard. Yeah, it looks like he's doing a good job leading since Belly has passed away. I'd like him to meet Undine. He'd be so happy. Not right now. Once everything's settled down, though, let's give him a nice surprise. Okay. That monster. Paul Australia was no match for it. I can't figure it out. So how did we take it out? Maybe there's something. I see a quote of us going, "Hey, Kira, don't don't you know that her wife came back from the dead? Yeah, but she's been working real hard lately. Let's just not show her. <laughs> we'll show her later. The spirits, perhaps. Wink." If the Autophagos really is close to air, then the spirits might actually affect it. So can we put up more of a fight if His we unethical relationship, uh, goals. Um, Bianca finds out, Bianca's like, air, shh, 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 but we're talking about forget the about it. I just don't know. Yeah, and it's not like he can find Apathea lying around just anywhere. There aren't many Entelechaeus either. I'll tell her later. <laughs> hey. There are tons On her of fucking deathbed. Oh yeah, she was alive. Yes, they're an indispensable part of our society. And cores are just pieces of apatheia. So if the four spirits aren't enough, we can just change all the cores of the world into spirits too, right? Hmm. Then we may end up with as many spirits as there are grains of sand. Are you nuts? How do you propose to do that? Even if we knew how, we'd still have to go to every single Blastia. I doubt the Autophagos would wait for us. I think that's your specialty, genius. Oh no! This is your genius plan! Even if Yuri's plan worked, all the Blastia would stop working, wouldn't they? Yeah, I guess so. All the cores would be gone. What would the world become? People would lose the safety promised by the barriers. All the functions that the Blastia maintained... gone. It'll be inconvenient, to say the least. Even Bodhi Blastia wouldn't work! Fine. <sighs> It all comes together. Apparently, we figure out a different method of mana. is all I need to cross the ocean. I admire your spirit, Patty. Well, isn't that all fine and dandy? There will be a lot of unhappy people, but we have to do it. Otherwise, the world will fall to the Autophagos, even if no one else ever understands why. Well, for now, let's just get the four elemental spirits. Aye. We'll cross those other bridges when we come to them. Baul knows where the other Antelikea are, right? Yeah. Let's get back to the ship and ask him. Well, we have a job. So for now, that gave me like half bars. It's very weird to me to see, like, a spike whip being an actual weapon <laughs> with, like, stats. Because I'm just so used to the Dragon Quest, the Thorn Whip being the second whip. <laughs> you have a couple of people who certainly need to, uh... Like, she needs a lance, he needs a bow. See if we can't get him one real fast. Something to chew on.
We run out of shit to sell. What if my second character in your campaign is the lucky pirate class? <laughs> I had that random thought just now. No. That'd be dumb. Also, it'd be impossible to incorporate. She's too complicated. It's a little bit. Also, it wouldn't fit at all, the theming. That's the other thing. I can see the theming work. It'd be weird. There's nothing wrong with making a pirate with a personal. That's about gambling. Yeah, but that's, you know. That was just a pure meme, anyway. I'm not actually planning on doing that, but... I might do a gun class, but, uh... We'll see. You could be horse, pony, gun. Horse, pony, gun? Oh, Sunset Rider? Yeah. You mean? Hmm, maybe. I don't know. The hey, Bob, where the hell are we going? The area Lumen, and the root of the world, Reloise. I've never heard of those places. If only we could glimpse them. Would make things far easier. <sighs> Baul says he knows. However, hmm. he doesn't want to tell us. Apatheas only come from the death of Intelikea. He doesn't want to put his friends in danger. Baul, listen. We want to protect the world, but we don't want to sacrifice anyone for it. We won't just take the Apatheia by force. Baul, please. Tell us where the Intelikea are. Or else. I understood that. Area Lumen is in the northeast part of Tolbikia. Reloise is on the continent of Wakea. Thank you, Baul. We also need to go to the sands of Kogor, where Pharaoh is. A Pharaoh, right? Northeast. Wakea is that continent to the south of Ilikia, where the capital is, right? Wakea. The Emperor Calx the Third sent scouting parties four times in order to claim the land, but every time they lost communication and no one ever returned. It's the last unexplored land on Terkalumares. Why does it have to be a place like that? If Wake is that bad, then let's leave Reloise for last. He says he'll leave things up to you. Thanks, Baul. Let's go. I forgot you had the stupid dog tail. <laughs> Just the dog too. <laughs> we can't exactly dawdle forever. She's a Karane fan. Don't mind. Who is? So I can't remember if this one is actually last, but I guess we can go see Pharaoh first. Fuck it. Hey, Pharaoh, we want your soul. I think Fuck. he's right there. Thank you. Ow. Oh, no. Uh, oh, he is flying around. Okay. Just, uh, hey, Pharaoh. Oh, God. <laughs> I thought he'd be on his little Pharaoh! rocks, but okay. <laughs> he's hurt. Why is he flying? Any idiot could come along and take him out. He couldn't put up a fight like this. It's probably so humans won't get his apatheia. Human greed knows no bounds. Even the sky offers no sanctuary. Then there really isn't anywhere that's safe. Pharaoh! Hey, he's landing! I it looks like he's calling us. Let's go. Pharaoh? Pharaoh, come on! I'm sorry. It was all for us. What do you mean? Pharaoh was a decoy for us at Zaude. The fate of the world is set. We shall meet our end. Duty unfulfilled. How unfortunate. You give up pretty fast for someone who fought for so long. Sorry. But things aren't over yet. Zaude is lost. The Adefagos has returned. Neither humans nor we possess the power of old. What more can be done? 
There's still hope. There's a new power. We would like you to become a spirit. A being that can control air even more. But to do that, we need your apatheia. You ask me to hand over my life. <sighs> your heart alone cannot save the world. But you must have the heart to save it. I am not long for this world. Do with me as you please. That's mini game on his corpse. Yeah. That made me like think like you. That suddenly made me think like Fortnite default days on this corpse. Mm -hmm. Just mini game on his corpse. What if he doesn't help us when he becomes a spirit? Pharaoh loves the world. It'll be fine. See, this is why we don't give you nice things, Carol. Put them back in the towel. <laughs> <laughs> oh my guys, I just made one bad face. That's one too many, Carol. Patty gets to make all the bad faces she wants. Yeah, I guess yeah, well. that's fair. <laughs> but the air crane here is all dried up. Can you summon a time stopping ability? Can no. you summon a magical fountain that does a fuck ton of damage and fully heals everybody in the party? No. Including but their TP? Can she heal anyone outside of battle? If I follow the flow of the air, um, I should be able to. Uh, she might actually be able to. <laughs> I think Big Chef does it. Sure? I think she actually can. Undine is <laughs> telling me that. Okay. We've never tried, but I'm pretty sure she can. <laughs> no mini game on his corpse. He just works. Looks a little different in this game. Yeah, a little dumpty. Hey, 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 hey! Hot, hot, hot! Is he like a weird fucking lizard genie? <laughs> the spirit of fire. <laughs> I feel unlimited power. It has been a long time, hasn't it, my leader? <laughs> I congratulate you on your conversion. Such consideration. Bellius? So you too have. I am now called Undine, the ruler of the waters. I have changed form. So I, too, require a new name. You, who have reincarnated me, give me a name. The fearsome, fiery, fireball king! Such a powerful, terrible fire. The blazing one, Efreet. I am now connected strongly to the world. And all seems new again. Even this wasteland is filled with power. <laughs> Wonderful! And he went from, like, this noble, like... He flew away! He ch changed personality completely. Hey, where are you off to? <laughs> Fear not. We are bound to you. Wherever you go, we are with you. The fucking voice direction in this game is terrible. Fear not! <laughs> Fear not! <laughs> the full moon bears spirits. Nature's providence is great indeed. Yeah, of course the big boob women would say that. Yeah, nature's providence is really Man, kind to you. They're so different before and after becoming spirits. They have totally different points of view. It's like, imagine if a fish became a bird. This is better for them than being some sage, always worrying about the world. Yeah, instead they're all powerful gods? Yeah. We well, thought how well you, that worked for Zeus. You know, we're up to our That's eyeballs good, and problems. That's good, like... Save when the they're sure good, the but busy. there's no saying that well, that'll always be the case. Yeah, along came Then along came Juice. He hurled his dick into everything he could find. A lot. I hear that. Fate is And Hera got really pissed. <laughs> After everything that's happened, bit. I'm starting to wonder myself. But hey, I've done a pretty good I mean, job dude, of getting us out of whatever mess we're in, right? Dude, during his dad tried to kill him like a hundred right? times. You gotta at least give me some credit there. Yeah, I mean, he carved his way out of the stomach of his dad. Maybe that attitude's what's kept us seeing the light at the end of the tunnel. Gotta love the power of positive thinking. 
course, it's a whole fucking mess because Hera is literally his sister, so that's another thing. Oh, the, they're, they're all in, in sexual. Yeah, they're all they're them. all literally brothers and sisters because they were all the child of the, that guy that they carved out of the stomach of. You know, that's a whole thing. So you know, when you know, just how it is, Alabama. Yeah, you know, it's fine. I mean, there's, there's plenty of minor gods, because Zeus went around fucking literally everything he could stick his dick in, so, like, it's fine. <laughs> Is this the one I have to do last? And honestly, Hera fucked a lot of people, too. But that's another thing. <laughs> they all fucked a lot of people. That was a big thing. Rather we follow. They told you to come here last. Who cares? Fuck it, I'll go there now. I'm gonna so say this is Reloise? Yes, Baul yes, says, says it is. <laughs> I- look, look, it's fine if you want to make it echoey, but... <laughs> nah, We're not in a cave! It's a ravine! I don't- <laughs> Someone really loved Audacity. <laughs> Looks like we can take this path down. It wouldn't... This it's a long way down. landmass wouldn't make echoes like this. Yes, it is. Now that is a sight to behold. Please be careful not to fall, Patty. Carol's the one you ought to be worrying about taking a tumble here. Yeah, he is. That's not true. Let's get going. Let's get going. Yes, yes, it looks like that's all I hope it's do. like this during battle as well. Hey! No, oh, wait, be, hey, oh, wait, 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 No. No, it's narrow, and the wind is all over the place. It's a little too dangerous. This wind is fierce indeed. This place must be where Wait, you mean to tell me there's a fierce wind, too? Yeah. How are we hearing this echo, then? The mother of the wind, huh? I can see a Just wind good fucking water. luck hearing an echo when there's a wind. Ah. This is wind does wind carry sound. It kind of negates echoes. Ah, power of nature. Who knows how long it took to make this? I thought that was his inner thoughts for a second. <laughs> I was going to die. His inner thoughts Whoa. are echoing. I get all dizzy when I look straight down. It's like an oddly good animation. <laughs> See, Carol, this is why you can't have nice things. <laughs> <laughs> well, just make sure you don't slip and fall. Oh, thank fucking God. We're lucky Pharaoh decided to help oh, us. Oh, I was out. hoping we could just go into this. But there's no doubt he cares for this world, just like Judy said. If they had said, continued it into heart to heart, so what the fuck they are? He has helped us out all this That'd time. Be great. We must defeat the Autophagos and save the world for Pharaoh and his love of the world. Uh, no cheesy lines. Part? Yeah, come on. Honestly, you two should learn to show your I don't feelings. Hmm. What? Do you remember what game it is? It's heart to heart. Is that Xenoblade? Yes. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense why I called that a heart to heart then. That's the same thing, basically. Except not with like relationship levels being needed. I remember this guy. This guy looks like Don Fan to me. We'll destroy them in no time. Not this guy. Uh, I need to remember which one of my things is gold steel. It's on my ZR. I know that. Or my. Oh, it got deleted. Oh, no, there it is. Uh, it's just a neutral. Okay. Six thousand. All right. All oh, right. Uh, I forgot. I also. Uh, the fucking miss. That was so easy. Holy shit! We beat his ass. It fucking destroyed. Okay, staff. She got her new weapon anyway. Hey, went all out of your way to make something new for her, and then she got touched down. <laughs> okay. And then Rod. I mean, that's good. It's just why... Nuts. <clears throat> We must be cautious. Just 
rocks hurt. <laughs> Eddie has so many of those. <laughs> She's not like the rest of the characters. The rest of the characters like have this thing where like they only have one. She's got a uh, melee and range for each direction. So she always hits. I guess it makes sense she has a gun, whereas the rest of them just have like swords or whatever, but you know. Raven probably has a ranged uh, finisher for all of his as well. This one's strong. This one's for real. These rocks need to stop. Why is she calling it Fatal Circle? <laughs> She's saying Fatal Circle. Yeah, I know, but it's Fatal Triangle. <laughs> if I can get like a oh. single enemy by himself, then I can just do it. Nice. Also, also, Fatal Triangle is really good at setting up those fucking uh, finishers. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, but you're going. They're gonna be in the way. You might as well be free. Just fucking make some happen. <clears throat> oh, I'm with I got one free anyway. Didn't get it free. I think you like crafted it or something, but yeah. You know. I suppose I could try. Ow. They have to do a hit chain. It's not 69, but it's not bad. Yeah. Well. I guess we're not powerful enough to get rid of pillar chunks. <laughs> no. Distinctly different from rocks. The sun is a deadly laser. Oh, by the way, if you wonder what Griffin looks like, that big guy that's near the hot springs, yeah. that that creature right there, there you're beating up looks exactly like that, but way bigger. Guess I got lazy.
contract. Hmm. Gotcha. Here's a nasty one. Get ready for anything. I'm done with the hand axe. I want to equip its skill, but I'm done with it. Every time I fucking grenade myself, it's funny to me. <laughs> Do we just get a lizard man's contract? Yeah, contract for lizard man. Alright, still good on all of them. This one's That's like blatantly a Yu-Gi-Oh card. That's literally one of the battle wasps. <laughs> Possibly. I mean, this guy existed first because this game came out well before the Battle Wasp archetype, but nonetheless. shit to work on. Ooh, that's probably really good. Yeah. It's rare to find a dog wearing one of these these days. <laughs> what the fuck is that statement? As if it was common at one point? You know... Death Slinger. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's. Uh, hey, D, what new bow do you want? Death Slinger! Uh, no, D, I think that's a little dangerous for you. Wouldn't it be much nice to have, like, Camellia, oh, Dandelion, Doom Launcher? What happened to my TP? I guess I use it all. Never mind. That took forever. And when I don't have fucking Patty, um, Your Patty make get babbles go faster. Patty fucking wrecks enemies, but that's just because she's overpowered. Like <laughs> DLC uh, character would be overpowered. I have been trained by knights. I won't lose.
I genuinely think Fatal Triangle is half of why these battles are going so fucking fast, because it just sets up those insta-kills, like, constantly. <laughs> yeah. Still very confusing why she keeps saying Fatal Circle, though. It's the circle. It's welcome to society. This one's pretty tough. We must be cautious. Gotta hate this fucking rock so much. Some TP back. Oh, I accidentally did fail circle. It's fine. Just kill it. Well, you certainly know which button it is now. Uh, which button is what? Is that the fatal strike. Oh, that's just. Oh yeah. Did you I get do that for free? Now. No, that. Yeah, that was the one that we were gonna have to grind for. Nice. Uh, you got it for free. All right. Well, I'm still working on this, but we'll work on that. Now you can get Mahjong. Counts. Now I get Mahjong, which is probably... Here's the thing about Mahjong. Um, I literally have to spam it, not just so I can learn it, but because it sucks ass until you use it a bunch of times. It literally gets better every time you use it. Mahjong? So, yeah. The way that it works is when you originally get it, when the blocks fall, they only do one damage per block. That's like after like 30 uses, then they do 50 or 10 damage. Then after, like, some amount, it's 100 per block. And that's as high as it gets, but then, um... Ooh, mm. that's neat. It's a lot of TP. It's good for me. I mean, it's good for literally anybody. That's just, like, a good increase. There's nobody that wouldn't enjoy I lose 100 agility, though. Matters a lot. As we know, T uh, agility does a lot. Um. Okay, pal. Keep your eyes on my sword. Come on, give me a snow cone. There we go. I went down the way I went already. Yep. You sure did. God damn it. Let's eliminate them. I haven't used Fatal Triangle a hundred times yet, but it's fine. We'll get there. We shall get there. Thick. Charge! 
We're out. Have you ever played one of those RPGs where if you escape from a battle, you can instantly get back into another battle? The Dragon Quest games with overworld encounters let that happen, but not <clears throat> with the same enemy. Yeah. So, like, if there's two enemies stacked on top of each other and you escape, then you can encounter the other one. Such a demoralizing feeling. But if you would then escape from that one, then you have immunity frames from both of them. So, upsides. <laughs> Because it does remember you had immunity frames backlogged. But it... Come on, lad! Heave ho! Just keep going! Isn't hey, he good in the heat? Hang on! This kind of stuff gets to us, old folks. He is climbing down Come a cliff. On, man. <clears throat> yes. Yeah, you're gonna have to climb back up when we're done. He's dead. Someone's coming! Person? Here? No, hey, Duke. Duke. You. Duke. Appearing out of nowhere as usual. Snooping as usual, I see. Many thanks for rescuing Yuri. Mr. Potter? I don't know who, what you're referring to. Uh, Robotnik from the Sonic show when he goes snooping as usual, I see. So when he says mm. snooping as usual it's where the pingus comes from why are you the one thanking him mm. what are you doing here we heard there was an antilochia here we came to ask it to become a spirit a spirit a being that comes from reincarnating an antilochia through an apatheia we might be able to solve the air problem completely with the spirit's power by converting air into mana i have a problem with this what's I your problem I, I, I just do. I see. That's why. Duke, I want the world to be destroyed. I'm a vampire or something. I don't you know. You are trying to remake the world itself. All to solve a problem that humans themselves brought about. Whatever, man. Such arrogance. But if we don't fix the air problem, the Autophagos will destroy the world. Bellius understood. What do you want the animals and all those things to suffer as well? Like. She became Undine and is lending us her power. Pharaoh as well. He was reborn as a freak. Indeed! Humans in Entelakea can find a way to coexist by pushing these boundaries. Even so, I do not accept it. I will protect this world. You said that before. So just how do you plan to protect the world? I will not interfere with you, so do not interfere with me. Ahead lies one of the oldest springs in the world. Pay it due respect. So you won't answer the main question? Mm. Farewell. He growled. That was his answer. That's not good enough. Fuck uh, you. Hey! He's gone! Such a warm and fun-loving little fellow. I wonder what he's trying to do. I don't know, but I have a bad feeling about it. Let me go ask him. Not a soul alive would refuse to answer a beautiful laugh. Patty, darling, you just don't have the good graces for an it's approach. It's the fatty like face again. Rita, is something wrong? Well. I bet with his sword, with Dane Nomos, we could focus the spirit's energy on the Autophagos. Yeah, it's in a drink. Should we chase Not him really. down and ask him to lend <clears throat> it to us? Back. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's in much totally of a mood <clears throat> right now. Me neither. Well, whatever we do, we have to get Are all your the balls just dropped, Carol? What the fuck was Let's that? Focus on that Me neither. Me neither. It looks like a completely different person. Who the fuck said that? It's not a cleaver. Nice. Well, a minute halfway. I'm pretty, pretty much falling asleep right now. Alright, that's fine.
So that's probably pretty good. We can even put this on the dog and do some other shit. Runners and runners too. It's actually okay. decent for him because he's like, you know. He run. He run. He he, well, that, that's his whole mechanic is that he's fast. But mostly he dog. That, that literally, like, as, as, as far as I can tell, that's his major selling point as a character. He run fast. Ah, uh, he has a couple different things. He's very fast, very combo heavy. Uh, okay. he Explain cheeses over why... limits really hard, and he has a lot of really nice utility. Okay. Most of those things also apply to Yuri. Yuri... Oh, wait, hold on. What the fuck happened? We don't have 69 anymore. Oh, no, we got 74. When did that happen? Ah, oh, shit. Oh man, 74 isn't funny. Damn. We ruined the playthrough. We have to restart. It was bound to fucking happen. I got yeah, something that gives me A's during my Mystic Art to increase the number of hits. Something like that. Or happen. if I fucking, uh, I don't know. It, w it was in this dungeon, I think, that that happened. But... Mystic Art is special, right? That's nah, yeah, it's burst art. Yeah, so okay. So mystic art is what you use during the thing. Yeah, during over limit, but not the burst art. <laughs> yeah, so you're special. That's yeah. actually pretty fucking good. What that allows me to do is increase the number of hits and spam the combo. We'll mm -hmm. get to another funny number. We just have to get to 169. Okay, that's not going to happen. Probably, probably not. It Thank took you. us this long to get five more hits. Anyway, yeah. That'll do it for this session. Bye, 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 bye.